You see, he was running like mad to get his head through that. Look. You know, for somebody like Steve, who is a shoe guru, he's probably been to Barcelona 30 times. So he really knows what to look for. He knows the usual suspects, but he's also very young at heart and watching what all the kids are wearing. We are checking out the shops. Looking for trends, looking for colour materials. Anything that catches our eye. Yeah. It's a quick trip. We're sort of in and out. You can get a feel about what's going on really quickly. You've got good old classic hand tools. Exactly. What's so good about footwear design is that it's craft meets technology. And so no matter how technical it gets, there's still that cobbler craftsman thing going on. Yeah, I like that. European fashion is very fast. The heels are higher or the toes are pointier. So it's our job to recognise what's happening. So it's trend right, but on the other hand, it's not so extreme that nobody will want it. I think so, yeah. They're very sturdy though, stainless steel flip flops. That's the reason why we come here. It's for the smaller sort of mum and pop type stores. But for me, I'm all about true shoemaking. You know, the devil's in the details. And we sweat the details oh, because that's place. what makes a better shoe. Yeah, yeah, nice and that's the high street. Yeah, brace ourselves. <laughs> mm -hmm. This is one of our probably most intense shopping days. We need to find a hot fashion item that's going to be the must-have next year. 